Carteret County is one of the first school systems in the east to utilize lap shoulder seat belts on school buses. Now they're adding even more. It's all in an effort to keep your child safe. WNCT's Elizabeth Tu tells us how the belts are making a difference. Carteret County Schools was one of the first 11 school systems in our state to get behind a new initiative that was putting lap shoulder seat belts like these in its school buses. The overall goal is to increase your child's safety while they travel to and from school. The belts are installed in 28 out of 100 buses within Carteret County thanks to these new additions for next school year. This comes as the NTSB recommended last week that all new large school buses be equipped with lap shoulder belts. The upgrades to Carteret's buses were paid for by the state and that number will soon increase. To a way that the state was going to pay for it then. Um, so we didn't want to get left behind and have to, you know, take a chance on that cost being, you know, to the local government. So we said, you know, hey, let's go ahead and let the state pay for them and um, make the buses safer. So we jumped on it. Willis points out that buses are one of the safest ways to transport your student to school even without the belts, but the new additions will provide extra safety during a side impact or rollover accident. Carteret County was one of 11 school districts to ask for them from the Department of Public Instruction four years ago. It costs between 10 and $12,000 to equip each bus with the belts. The school system says it hopes that next year it can get six additional new buses, bringing the grand total up to 34. In Carteret County, Elizabeth Tew, nine on your side.